Time for a look at sports. Harry Chickman has got the action. What's happening? Oh, so much great action. Summertime in full swing. A lot of great sports teams. And we begin at City Field, where the Mets and Cubs were in action this evening, with New York looking to maintain its second place position in the NL East. And it was all tied at two in the fifth inning, where we picked things up. And that's when the Cubs start dominating Johan Santana. Anthony Rizzo had a hot bat. This one deep to right for a three run shot and his fourth home run of the year. Anthony went four for five on the evening. Five 5-2 Cubs. Just two batters later, Jeff Baker pulls this one to left for his second hit of the night. It's a solo blast, 6-2 Chicago. The Mets fall 8-7 the final game two set for tomorrow at 4 p.m. And the best tennis players in the world battled in London today for a spot in the coveted Wimbledon finals. The Fortnite winding down at the All England Club. This immense final four matchup, six-time champion Roger Federer taking down defending champ Novak Djokovic. Roger needs Needed four sets to beat the top player in the world, putting him in the finals for a record eight times. Also, England's own Andy Murray taking care of business, a four set winner over the number five seed Joe Wilfred Sanga, moving to the Wimbledon finals for the first time in his career. Sources are reporting that Jeremy Lin has accepted a four year, $28.8 million deal to play for the Houston Rockets. The New York Knicks have five days to match this offer or let Jeremy leave for Texas. As for the Nets, they continue to cultivate their young talent today at the team's rookie minicamp. All eyes were on local New Jersey heroes Tyshawn Taylor and Ashton Gibbs. Taylor hails from Hoboken and helped Kansas to the national championship game last year. And he comes to Brooklyn as the team's top recruit. Meanwhile, Gibbs comes from Scotch Plains and hopes to earn his right to play in the NBA as an undrafted free agent. Needless to say, both players are living a dream in New York City. I feel it's good. I'm definitely comfortable being in New Jersey. So now I'm just trying to work my hardest to, uh, to do my job. And that's uh, make shots and at the end of the day, uh, play my hardest on defense too. So bring energy to the team overall. It's exciting, you know. I, um, I jumped up when I heard my name called for Brooklyn, um, and I, I was really excited because I knew it was an opportunity to do something positive and, you know, in my area, in my neck of the woods. So I'm, I'm really excited about this opportunity and, and looking forward to it. So much to look forward to. New Jersey, New York, definitely the capital of basketball throughout mm -hmm. the world. Oh, yeah. You know those guys are hyped. Man. Oh, they big are ready time. To play. The fans are ready, too. Perfect for them. Thanks, Thanks Harry. Man.